Hello everyone and welcome to Movie Review UK and my first review of 2017 which is Moana. This is the new Disney movie which came out actually several weeks ago in the United Kingdom and even further ago still in the US but I thought it pertinent to open up the New Year's reviews with some fantastic movies and that does mean that this is a fantastic movie. I hope I'm not fumbling on the pronunciation of this but Ale Cravalo, definitely am. Ali Ali Cravalo, ignorant, ignorant English person, voices Moana and she does a fantastic job. I also think the animation on Moana herself and the emotions in her face are actually extraordinary. I really noticed the cool empathy, cool, stupid. I really noticed the really fantastic emotions displayed and I think it made Moana one of the most endearing Disney princess type characters that I've ever seen. Indeed, I think she might be my favourite. She's got a lot, a lot of mozzo. She's gutsy. She's got ambition and passion and she's brave. And all of these qualities really have you rooting for Moana throughout the film as she deals with physical and emotional challenges. Dwayne The Rock Johnson plays Maui. There we go, that pronunciation is a little bit easier. He plays Maui who is a demigod and uh, basically, not going to spoil anything, but basically friend and team upper of Moana. And he adds a great amount of comic relief to the movie. He's very bold, uh, very brash, and he's it's got some really unique elements to it, like his tattoos, uh, which kind of move, and so he interacts with them. And they uh, they have some real, real impact on the movie in terms of storytelling and it's just it's a very charming movie in this regard. It's very amusing like I say it's not got stupid silly childish humour uh, that you get in animated films like Madagascar which are the, the kind of animated films I don't really enjoy like Madagascar, Ice Age, they're all just a bit meh. But Disney films I usually give a fair chance and Moana definitely didn't disappoint. I actually put it in as high a regard as some of my other favourite Disney films like Frozen. I think that um, the last or the recent Disney attempts, I mean even looking at Zootropolis from last year, totally different kind of film. But equally fantastic. Moana is set in, I don't even know where, but certainly islands, you know, vast seas and tropical stunningly beautiful islands and that means that the visual effects and the just the whole animation style is incredible it really is a beautiful film it looks amazing the rich fertile ground the greenery uh, everything just looks so great and then the songs in it are few and far between but they are very good indeed some of them are very catchy <laughs> which I've listened to a few times since I saw the film. And it is captivating. It really is. It captures the Im imagination and the hearts of the viewers. It's quite an emotional... Bit, bit, bit. It's quite an emotional film in places. I found myself choked up a number of times. Um, and indeed, the, uh, kind of the, there is a very symbolic moment towards the end of the film that really got me uh, in, in an overwhelming and joyful way. Um, in fact, there's two... There's two two moments like that um, and it's, it's moments like that that have such emotional impact and power that make movies stay with you and they give you a good memory of them and so I have a very very good memory, a very fond memory of Moana even though I only saw it yesterday. Really superb film if you have uh, seen the trailer or, or just heard about it and dismissed it I would definitely tell you to not dismiss it, uh, try and take the opportunity to see it in the cinema whilst it's still there at the very least, check it out on Blu-ray or high-definition formats when it was released in the home. I would give it a very solid 8 out of 10. Thank you very much for watching Movie Review UK. We've got plenty more reviews to come in the new year with lots of uh, screen unscenes, Odin screen unscenes, where they show you a film before it's been released. There's plenty of those. There's, in fact, two coming very soon. Scream unseen and screen unseen, so I'll be doing them very shortly. Thanks again for watching and subscribe for more videos.